Washington slash Seoul, Reuters, the White House on Wednesday defended Donald Trump a Euro trademark s tweet about the size of his nuclear button, saying Americans should be concerned about the North Korean leader a Euro trademark s mental fitness, not their presidential Euro s. On Tuesday, Trump responded to a New Year a Euro trademark s day speech in which North Korean leader Kim Jong Un warned he had a nuclear button on his desk by saying that his nuclear button a Euro or a a much bigger and more powerful one than his, and my button works. A Euro. The tweet provoked strong criticism, especially from Trump a Euro trademark s Democratic opponents, and former Vice President Joe Biden called it dangerously cavalier. Asked whether Americans should be concerned about the presidential Euro trademark s mental fitness after he appeared to be speaking so lightly about nuclear threats, White House spokeswoman Sarah Sanders told a regular news briefing. A Euro the president and the people of this country should be concerned about the mental fitness of the leader of North Korea. A Euro e he a Euro trademark s made repeated threats, he Euro trademark s tested missiles time and time again for years, and this is a president wo Euro trademark s not going to cower down and wo Euro trademark s not going to be weak and is going to make sure that he does what he Euro trademark s promised to do and that is stand up and protect the American people a Euro. Trump and Kim have exchanged repeated insults in recent months in a crisis over North Korea a Euro trademark s program to develop nuclear-tipped missiles capable of reaching the United States, raising alarm worldwide. Trump has at times appeared to dismiss the prospect of a diplomatic solution and both sides have threatened to destroy each other. Former Vice President Joe Biden said Trump had shown a Euro really poor judgment a Euro. A Euro or eth only war that is worse than one that a Euro trademark s intended, is one that is not intended a Euro bidden was quoted as saying by CNN. A Euro or ethies is not a game. This is not about, you know, can I puff my chest out a Euro. A Euro or eth United States has a role in the world that the world has come to expect. I think the president is much, much too cavalier. And eat a Euro trademark s dangerous a Euro. Senator Edward Markey, the top Democrat on the Senate a Euro trademark s East Asia subcommittee, said Trump a Euro trademark s tweet a Euro e bordered on presidential malpractice, needlessly deepening a crisis and squandering a fresh opportunity to attempt diplomacy a Euro. In his New Year speech, Kim warned that the entire United States was in range of North Korea nuclear missiles and added, a Euro e a nuclear button is always on my desk. This is reality not a threat a euro. Kim said his country would focus in the coming year on mass producing nuclear warheads and ballistic missiles for operational deployment, but added that these would be used only if North Korea a euro trademark s security was threatened. US Vice President Mike Pence told the Voice of America Trump was making clear that a euro or America will not be bullied, America will not be threatened a euro. He said that while all options remained on the table, there was the opportunity for a peaceable solution to the crisis if a Euro e North Korea will abandon their nuclear and ballistic missile ambitions, if they will dismantle those programs a Euro. Hotline reopened. In his address, Kim also said he was open to speaking with US ally South Korea and would consider sending a delegation to the Winter Olympics to be held in South Korea in February. U.S. officials have responded coolly to this overture and the State Department said North Korea a Euro might be trying to drive a wedge a Euro between Washington and Seoul. On Tuesday, Nikki Haley, the U.S. ambassador to the United Nations, said Washington would not take any talks between North and South Korea seriously if they did not contribute to denuclearizing North Korea. Haley also said Washington was hearing reports that Pyongyang might be preparing to fire another missile and warned of even tougher steps in response if it did so. On Tuesday, Seoul responded to Kim by proposing high-level discussions at the heavily armed Korean border next week, and on Wednesday North Korea reopened a border hotline that had been closed since February 2016. South Korean officials at the border received a call from the North at 6.30 GMT and officials on both sides conducted a conversation for about 20 minutes, South Korea a Euro trademark s unification ministry said. It did not disclose the content of the discussion. There was no immediate US comment on the reopening of the hotline, although a State Department spokeswoman, Katina Adams, 
said Washington remained in close contact with Seoul a euro or e about a unified response to North Korea a euro. She said that as South Korea President Moon Jae-in had stated, a euro o e a euro the improvement of relations between North and South Korea cannot advance separately from resolving North Korea a euro trademark s nuclear program a euro. The reopening of the hotline came hours after the tweet from Trump, who has repeatedly mocked Kim as a euro a little rocket mon a euro. Kim a euro trademark s new year a euro trademark s day speech followed a steep increase in missile launches by North Korea in 2017, as well as its sixth and most powerful nuclear test. North Korea a euro trademark s KCNA news agency quoted R.I. Sung Won, chairman of North Korea a euro trademark s committee for the peaceful reunification of the fatherland, as saying talks with South Korea would aim to establish formal dialogue about sending a North Korean delegation to the Olympics. A euro we will try to keep close communications with the South Korean side from sincere stand, sick, an honest attitude, true to the intention of our supreme leadership, and deal with the practical matters related to the dispatch of our delegation a euro he said. Chinese Foreign Ministry spokesman Geng Shuang said both sides should seize the Olympics as an opportunity to improve ties and make concrete efforts toward alleviating tension.